Outside the Federal High Court in Nigeria's Lagos, it's a day of celebration. <laughs> After a judge threw out a case against 47 men charged with public displays of affection with members of the same sex. I'm free. I'm free to travel around the country. I'm free to fly. Yeah. It means a lot of good things. Yeah, I'm very free. <laughs> The men were being charged under a 2014 law that banned gay marriage and same-sex amorous relationships and that prompted international outcry when it came into force. But the case was struck out by Justice Rilwan Aikawa because of a lack of diligent prosecution. Prosecutors have previously failed to present witnesses in a case that has been adjourned several times. On Tuesday, they didn't even show up. The 47 men were arrested in a raid on a Lagos hotel in 2018. Police accused them of taking part in a gay initiation ceremony. The men said it was a birthday party. The specific charge the men faced carried a jail sentence of up to 10 years. And because the case has been struck out rather than dismissed entirely, under Nigerian law they could be rearrested and arraigned again on the same charges. Outside the court, taxi driver Onyeka Ogwagamba, who said he had merely driven people to the party, is disappointed. I'm not happy. Because I'm looking towards the matter that the matter will end in a way that people will see me and believe what I, I've been saying from the beginning of this matter. Some of the men have previously complained that the damage has already been done, saying they have been stigmatized in the socially conservative country since the raid and a televised news conference the next day in which they were identified. <laughs>